In this first lesson, all we're going to do is memorize one little five note pattern. That's all we're going to do. We're just going to learn it and memorize it, and then we're going to move on to the next lesson. So let me show you the little five note pattern, and then I'll break it down for you so you can see exactly which notes to play. So what I'm going to do is come to my ninth fret, and I'm going to start right here, and this is the pattern. That's literally it. I'm going to play it quick on purpose. So that's all we're trying to do in this lesson, okay? That's the goal, is to memorize that one pattern. Now let me break it down and show you exactly which notes to play. So like I said, we're going to start on our ninth fret, and I want you to start with your middle finger on the G string, okay? Ninth fret, middle finger, G string. That's this note here, okay? The next note is going to be with your index finger or your pointer finger on the B string, and that's, also, that's going to be on the 8th fret. And then next is going to be the same string, the B string, but you're going to use your ring finger, and that's going to be on the 10th fret. So ring finger, 10th fret, B string. And then for the last two notes, we're going to repeat the notes on the same frets, but just on the high E string. So we're going to have 8th fret, uh, pointer finger, on the high E string, and then we're going to have ring finger, 10th fret, on the high E string. Okay? So here was our pattern. And you also want to be able to play this pattern backwards. Okay, it's a very, very simple pattern. And all we want to do in this lesson is just learn that pattern, starting on the 9th fret, and memorize it. That's all we want to do. We don't want to play it fast. We don't want to get fancy. We just want to make sure we have the notes down and we memorize this pattern and playing it backwards. That's all we want to do. So if you can do this, that's all you have to do and then move on to the next lesson.